This morning, we're digging deeper into a mystery in Oro Valley that's gone unsolved for eight years. If you've driven along La Cañada, you've probably noticed that metal tortoise on the side of the road just north of Tangerine. Now, just in time for the town's 50th anniversary, I got to find out who's been making it such a staple of the Oro Valley community. I have been uh, secretly uh, decorating this uh, tortoise for almost eight years. In the dark of night, I am the tortoise fairy. The tortoise fairy has been sneaking out before every holiday or big event to deck out this metal tortoise that so many have come to love. We wanted people to get a little bit of a laugh, a smile and a laugh. So we always tried to not only make it be like the holiday, but add a little bit of humor in there somehow. So uh, it really caught on. But years of building the costumes, props, and signs have taken a toll on this fairy. And she's getting ready to hang up her wings. So she finally agreed to reveal her true identity. My name is Lisa Powell. Meet Lisa Powell, the creative force behind Eat Tacos Responsibly for Cinco de Mayo, the tortoise school bus in the fall, setting your scales back 10 pounds at Thanksgiving, even her version of The Thing. It's a little surprising how much people did take a liking to it and when they talk about it it's like this is what makes this community and this is why i love to live here and lisa's labor of love has faced the elements rain snow 50 mile per hour winds the occasional javelina even a brief run-in with the law one evening my husband and i were decorating it and the police came and so the lights were going and we were like hey, yeah, well, we're busted uh th then the police officer came around you know our car and he was like oh oh Carry on. I, I got to text my wife and, and kids and let them know I saw the tortoise fairy. On another rare occasion where she got caught, There's Lisa says a man got emotional. He had been looking for her for three years just to tell her how much his late parents loved taking their picture in the Valentine's Day picture frame. It was something that his parents loved to come to and it was the last picture he had of them uh, smiling together. But while this tortoise fairy is retiring, this isn't the end. A group of tortoise fairies have now inherited Lisa's decorations. I think, you know, the traditional will carry on. Keeping the mystery alive as the new tortoise fairies secretly walk among us until the next big reveal. So now that we know who the tortoise fairy is, Lisa is actually going to be featured in the parade for Oro Valley's 50th year anniversary celebration. You can look for her. She'll be decked out in a tortoise shell and wings just celebrating this little piece of Oro Valley that is always good for a smile.